All right, we got some uh, Timo with Bandle City. So basically, like all in on shrooms type deck. Um, I don't mind keeping one combat cook. I think we want the um, the barnacles, bar knuckles. We'll go like that. I don't mind having the curve. Oh, we top decked it too. It's actually insane. Uh, we will go Elkin. A tough 3-3 three, three on turn 2 is pretty nuts. I can't lie. And then we will see if they have Teemo or not. Nothing. Alright, cool. And the plan is once we get some coins going, we can play the Sergeant and Fort Demacia later on just to close the game out if needed. I do think I'm playing the Castaway. Or could Sergeant. 3-3 three, three looks better. I mean, this could be like a bigger unit, but... Yeah, it's cool with me. Kind of set myself up for that. Maybe I shouldn't attack with it, but it'll be okay. So I could opt to go a little wide here and then play Garen next turn instead of going with like the combat cook. I think I will. Uh, yeah, I like fearsome. I go ways to find me mushrooms. I seek a weapon worthy of Naga Keboros. I mean, wouldn't we play Garen? This can still attack, nothing can kill it. For justice, for Demacia. I mean, we can't want to set ourselves up to Fort Demacia on our next attack. Take him with Garen, he will probably die. So I don't think I will. But I kind of want to make them block with the peddler. I'm sending in everything. I can't let the game go on too long because they get a shitload of shrooms and just lose that way, so. Garen will probably end up dying. This is going to die. I'll just throw the equipment onto the cultist and we'll call it a day. No is 100% going to die to Pythos. Or wall up that word. Alright, actually, I could go wide still in Fort Demacia. I could go Combat Cook, Morai Warden. Be five wide and then Fort Demacia next turn. I don't actually mind that. It sounds pretty decent. Um, this weapon's awful, honestly. I think I'm going Impact. I mean, they're not really going to attack anyways, but... I just don't like the uh, can't attack weapon or can't block. Hello, new best friend. Oh, that's probably the best one drop we could have hit. It's a three three now. Yeah, it's okay. 
And then what I might do, just make it harder to remove this. I'm just going to coin. And then... That's two health now. Nothing great, but... Honestly, I could put the weapon here and it would have proc faded. We do have 30 shrooms in the deck. Um, should I cultist and then four Demacia? Yeah, I need to end the game here, so I think I will. I'm kind of just letting them play Karina, though, but I don't think we'd die if they play it. Kind of just want to guarantee a win right here. Yeah, they have to play a blocker. For sure. Alright, cool. That was a good first game. Alright, something besides Teemo deck. That's nice. I've only gotten the Barnacle start once. Like, we have so many one drops, so it's basically guaranteed to get one. I guess I should have re rolled everything, but. Having Elkin on one, Barnacle on two, it's just a, like, e that's the start you want. I can't seem to get it to go, though. Because I'm just gonna play a bunch of one drops, just go really wide. Low. Okay. Still pushing four damage. They get like a pie toss for this. They don't. All right, cool. Or group shot. I know this deck runs a lot of like pings because that's a broad main deck. All right. Then we just have Jack, and then we're just kind of coming in. Pretty hard. God be king with that breaking a few bones. <laughs> they need to play something to block because I'm pushing a lot of damage here. Pushing 12 damage. I'm assuming this is the like deny <clears throat> the deny uh, unit, which is a three three, so they could block one of these two if they want to just waste it like that. Or not really waste, but use it like that. Going down to six, huh? On turn four. All right. I don't have the best hand. I don't have anything I can do this turn except play the cultist. That's actually pretty bad. That really kills like our tempo. I was hoping to end the game next turn, but I mean, actually, at the moment, they don't have anything to block Jack, so I could just form up him next turn. That's pretty nice, actually. Well, I guess if we just open attack right now, we have lethal. Because impact, then this does one damage, and Jack will do four, because they don't have a brash blocker right now. Alright, there's Nar. Who is going to level? Give me something good. I guess I'm playing Lionhawk. Uh, this is actually decent. 
and get four Demacia or in capture something, I would just take Tail Stones. Hmm. Am I gonna form up that? Make it so I stay wider than them. I might. I do want to be able to kill Nar though, right? We're gonna do it. They could have a second group shot. But I'm just gonna send everything in, I believe. There's no point in keeping Jack back because he's gonna, he's gonna die to Nar next turn, so. Alright, so we're one more wide than them. They have to block Jack with Nar. And then they just have horrible blocks all around. I mean, they can just bring one of these. I mean, it'd probably be like here and then here. I guess, it, yeah, they don't want to block with Nora. I don't know. They're in a real shitty spot, I can't lie. They, they can shoot this, I imagine. Second group shot, or they're gonna have Pytos for this. Okay, sure. Second Nora, okay. Alright, we have Tech Hunter to make another unit, so hopefully we can get something good with that. Mm, yeah, Deck Hunter and Garen maybe, or maybe a Garen next turn. I'm assuming they get some bad choices. They're taking a minute. We're actually lucky they have not found Broadman yet because I have no way to deal with him. So Broadman would hurt a lot. None of these are exactly great, I'll be honest. I mean, that's decent. I can like discard the coin, maybe. Maybe that's pretty dumb, actually. They're not attacking with Nar. I, mean, I do have a blocker for it, but I don't know. I kind of assume they would talk with Nar. I should not do this. I wouldn't mind setting up for a four Demacia next turn. Seven mana for Demacia. Um. 
kind of want to play Garen. All right, so next turn I go to eight mana. If I bank, I could bank three, so I'd be at 11. So I would not have enough to Garen and four Demacia. Because this is a seven mana one, so I need 12, okay. I'll just play Garen now. Get five mana. What do they got? You cannot stall judgment. I just was I could I could have coined the next turn and done it. So maybe I should have. I never play around my coins. I could coin and then play the rascal and get rid of the pot of pain, see what I get. I don't mind that actually. I was hoping to get the elusive, honestly. Uh that's actually not bad. That's not bad at all. Mirai Warden into this. Ah oh, shit, I'm actually too wide then. Um We'll just go like this. And we'll save some mana. I think I'm gonna need this uh like either a four Demacia later on or a capture maybe. Even barrier would be okay. I like having the tail stones, it gives you a lot of options. Alright, and they have pretty bad blocks. So I'm sending everything in. They have to block everything. Easy does it. Once again, they don't have Broadman yet, so... Actually, the Tails ones would be nice to capture, like a Broadman as soon as they play him or something. Because that's our biggest issue, is that they have Broadman. It'd be nice if we had, like, a like a couple Brass units. Like, if we had, like, a Jack and, like, the Barnacles. Because they... Look, look at their units. None of them, like, they have one blocker for it. I mean, Nar would have been earlier, but... Like, Brush is actually insane keyword. We just can't really... Get the stuff we need to take advantage of it. Is that wall up on Garen, I'm guessing? It's only thing I can imagine it would be. Yeah, it's a better block for them. Okay. I wonder if they're, they're waiting to like use this when they have brought me on the board or maybe they want to use it to get plunder for the um uh riptide rex all right so so no broad main and or riptide rex so they're bricking their hand pretty hard i can't lie I want to kill Nora, but she's actually like not that big of an issue. So, is it two out of six? Uh, 
Um, I'm gonna line out. Search warrants as you decent, I can't lie. So was repost though. We'll take search warrant. Alright, they can kill this. I'm just playing Mariah Warden and we're still gonna be we're gonna be so wide still. Two more portals in deck, so. Nice to meet you. I'm Isla. Oh, we got a 3-3 three, three with quick attack. That's pretty nuts, I can't lie. I'm scared they're gonna hit one of these portals. I wanna stay six, I wanna stay one more wide than they are, so. What if I just. I'm probably taking that away. I don't really have it for the Broadman anymore, but I'm, over, I'm trying to win next turn, so that's the idea. I could have captured Nora, but I don't think they should attack with this. I don't think that's right. They need to be just as wide as I am, so they have a blocker for everything. I mean, yeah, they get another portal, but not guaranteed he goes on top. And they literally have to block everything I have because everything has much power. So they have the two portals right here. They have four. So it's it's decent chance. Hey yo, you me just caught you lacking. Go subscribe. Uh yeah, I think I'm just sending it with everything. I could play Jack. They have a way to kill something. Okay, you're nice. I'll say I have a way to like give something barrier. All right, we have T the Teemo deck again. Just all in on germs. Um, no equipment again. A bit rough. This issue has a, I mean, this deck has a lot of one drops. Oh, I found the equipment, but oh, yeah, it's really my only issue with it. You like draw into a lot of like cheap units and uh, it just doesn't always feel good. We need to play for like the four Demacia. I think I'm just gonna play more units because the only thing they could have right here is like a peddler that could block the brass unit. So oh, that's actually a pretty uh pretty good one drop. Yeah, and they don't want to block with the peddler, so I seek a weapon worthy of Naga Keboros. They're gonna shoot this. They're gonna shoot that, okay. Just gonna send the brash in. Take my 
Or damage, and they didn't want to block, yeah. Could have sent everything in, but... I was just talking about I want to play for the Fort of Masia, so... Let me not do that. We're gonna play Garen next turn, and we're just gonna... Just gonna pound him. Yeah, this is a pretty good turn 5 attack, I can't lie. Garen might die, but I'm still saying everything in, so... You could, like, block with the 4-4, four, four, then uh, have, like, a pie toss or, um, like, the Poison Dart. But we're pushing a shitload of damage, so... There it is. I just hit the mic, sorry about that. Alright, we should give him an absolute shitload of mushrooms. It's four every damage we deal, so. Yeah, that was a lot. We have 60, okay. Let me start with Deck Hunter so we can find. That's actually pretty good. Plus one, plus one. Oh, wait, it's only Daybreak or it's only Nightfall Allies. Okay. I've never actually used that card, so. Uh, elusives. It's basically two elusives. Um, yeah, I'll take the booming. Sure. Then we'll just play Mariah Warden. I've never met anyone like you. Uh, yeah. Yeah, okay, any turn. I think we're just sending everything in. Except maybe the 1 3, because that's gonna get a free hit for mushrooms. They have nothing to block the brass units, so. That's pretty good. Blacking a shitload of coins. They're shooting Garen. Alright, well, Garen is level up, so that's nice. And they try to shoot him, I'm just seeing what combat the peddler. They have 86 shrooms in the deck. Alright, I'm just gonna put my own elusive, and then you have to shoot that instead of Garen. We get overwhelmed, it's not bad. Just shooting the Nexus. Okay. Fair enough. I wonder if they're gonna send Timo in, don't realize I have an elusive. I don't know why they didn't shoot that. Okay. Well, I hope they know I'm coming in for an attack right here, so... They're gonna have so many mushrooms in the deck. I hope they have a way to win right here. They could have like Karina or something. 
But we don't have very many in our deck, so we're kinda just chilling. Oh, they found me. Six, yes, not enough. Uh, I'm just gonna replace deck on turn and see what we get here. Uh, none of these are great, honestly. I guess silence for the peddler, maybe. I'll take another coin. Yeah, I guess we'll just go ahead and silence the peddler. Just so they can't do anything else, but pretty sure the game's gonna be over in a second. Second curry now, okay. Oh, they have 159 shrooms. I really hope they draw nine. I will take this power in my lady's name. Um Jack actually goes to leveling. I don't think it does anything though at all. I think the game's over right here, hopefully. Four, okay. They're, they're gonna end up like tying the game or something. I guess we're using that, sure. Careful now. What a mushroom help. Yeah, kind of sent Jack up to die, but we have another one, so. I have 10 coins in hand. This deck has no, like, draw, though. Oh, yeah, they're coming with the Karina. There's actually a chance we lose. They have 223 mushrooms in the deck. God be king with that breaking a few bones. <laughs> we have a genuine chance at losing. It's going to be a tie if we don't lose them. Seven. It's going to be a tie. They have 223 mushrooms in the deck. And we're going to tie. Yeah, this monument uh allows for some crazy shit to happen. I can't lie. Or they could have missing shot as a lose. Draw one, draw one mushroom. And 13. I drew one. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Another Teemo deck with Paragon. Pretty strange. Oh, we actually found the Barnacles. So let's look for a one drop now. We we got a one drop. I might just go I might just play everything right here. Play both cultists, play barnacles on this next turn. And then we'll just play Jack on four and Garen on five. Oh my, what a start we have. Is it Teemo? They do know that to get a big Teemo. Is this just like a pure elusive deck? I'm not sure that's Targon. Yeah, this is a pure elusive deck. Uh, let's put it. I don't think it really matters. Uh, we'll go here. Because I don't. I'm thinking about like Missy shot. I only have one target for it. 
That's a 4 4 Boro. Yeah, Targon and uh, Piltrover have a good bit of elusive, so I would imagine that's what we're going against. Especially when I saw them play this card. That's for sure what's going on. Let's see what we draw here. Okay, because I was thinking about, I was debating whether or not I should replay the Barnacles or just play Jack. But I'm thinking it's going to be Jack. Jack and Nagaran next turn. Looks pretty good. Wow, yeah. That's 10 elusive damage. What's the best way to go about this? Is it Mariah Warden Barnacles? Or this has got to be Garen, right? Garen could die. We need to send everything in. We, uh, we, we die next attack if we don't push Lethor right here, so. I need to be able to survive one more turn. What do they got? What do they got? Could be like Sunburst. I don't know what exactly this deck runs. I've never actually seen this before, so. Alright, it's not Sunburst. Double Mystic. That does not seem very good for them, I'll be honest. I, I need to force them to block with everything. They'll just block Garen with this, I'm sure, but I need that this to die or I'd lose on the next open attack. So if I hold Garen back, they'll just block Jack with this and then they'll just leave that back. We're looking good though. Unless they just have a shitload of Lucis here, which they could. It could be like the Nightfall elusive. Um, I don't know. I guess I just gotta hope they don't have it, because I don't really have a play. I don't have a way to take out anything. I didn't draw a fish fight, you see no combat or anything, so. That's game over, yeah. Damn, what the hell, dude? Forgive me. Fucking elusive, man. Holy. Look at we had such a good start too. It's crazy. Anyone who stands in my way. If you made it this far, it'd mean the world to me. If you like, subscribe, and have a great rest of your day.